Alright, so NVIDIA Ansel is probably going to be a game changer in terms of how we take screenshots and I thought I'd go over it today in a little bit more detail than I've seen it gone over in the past. First off, let's go over all the features that we know of. We have free camera, filters, EXR, super resolution, and the ability to take 360 degree shots. Now I'm going to go over each of these features in examples that we can already experience right now because Ansel isn't out yet. So first off, let's take a look at free camera. And let's say we're walking around the game world and we run into a scene that we just really wanna have more control over to get a screenshot. Basically what this does is it allows us to pause game time and then take complete control over the camera. So you can see the shell casings flying out of the gun, the guy getting knocked back by the explosion, basically gives us more creative ability. Next we have filters. Now what Ansel will do is allow us to apply live filters to our image and this is a process that would typically be done in post-production. So we can get a more immediate look at how the filters we want to apply are going to look on the image. As of right now we don't know too much about this but uh, I'm assuming we're going to be able to remove the filters if we want to in post-production. Next up we have EXR and EXR is basically a file format that allows us to choose our image's exposure in post-production and we can add extreme color modifications without introducing artifacts into the image. Now the best thing I can compare this to is raw files that we use in digital photography and raw files basically just give us a lot of image data that allow us to have more freedom in post-production. Next up we have super resolution which allows us to take screenshots at pixel counts that are well past the resolutions we're able to play games at right now. Now the best way to show this is to explain a feature in Overwatch that allows players to take images at nine times the resolution they're playing games at. So I'm going to compare an image I took with my DSLR, its pixel count, to the pixel count in a screenshot that I took in Overwatch. Now as you can see, the pixel count in the Overwatch screenshot is much greater, and in NVIDIA Ansel, we're going to be able to take screenshots that are 32 times the resolution we're playing at. So we're going to get some humongous images and a lot of pixels to play with. And the last feature we're going to get with Ansel is the ability to take 360 degree screenshots. And these screenshots are meant to be viewed with VR goggles. So basically you're able to take screenshots that are way more immersive than the traditional 2D ones. But uh, right here as I'm looking with mouse and keyboard, it's not as smooth. Thanks for watching this video and if you'd like to see some more video game or tech related news, you may enjoy PressingX.com which is the website that goes along with this channel. I try to get an article out each day over there. And along with the website, we also have a Twitter profile and a Steam group. And links for all three can be found in the description of this video. So, thanks for watching and have a great day.